This is the first stamp we're going to be making. It's a crane stamp. We're going to show you the technique on this. The first thing you want to do is you want to make sure to have a foam pad to do all your stamping on. The, uh, the next item that we're going to use is we're doing these different tools. We're going to use the uh, Perfect Pearls and we're going to use uh, Versamark ink, uh, Versamark and Q-tips. We're going to use uh, Versamark, Q-tips, uh, Perfect Pearls, uh, powder, and a Swiffer Swift Pad. Right. Uh, this is the dry pad. The dry pad. The dry Swiffer Pad. So uh, go to your supermarket and pick up some Swiffers. And uh, if you don't use them on the floor, you can use them on these projects. There you go. It's a lot right more here. fun. It is a lot more fun. So we're going to get started here. And uh, this is what we're going to do. Is you're going to take a uh, flat black piece of uh, uh, paper, black paper, and you're going to uh, stamp your pad, uh, your ink, your, uh, with the Versamark ink. Remember to uh, pat the stamp. Uh, don't uh, don't put the stamp against the uh, pad and pat on the floor. Uh, pat the stamp <laughs> on the floor. You need to get that into the camera there. There you go, so okay. they can see what they're doing. All right, now that you've thoroughly coated your stamp. You want to start again? No. No, I'll cut it out. Okay, now you're going to uh, uh, press firmly on your stamp. Are you pressing firmly, I'm pressing Glenn? very firmly. Very firmly. Okay. Excellent. Uh, you can go ahead and pull that away. And now you've got a, uh, you can actually see in the video here, you have a coating of uh, Versamark ink on there. And now we're going to put the perfect pearls on using a Q-tip. Now here's a little tip for you on the, uh, you want to make sure you get it into the camera. When you open up the perfect pearls, tap it. Tap it. You're not in the camera on that. Go ahead. All right. Now we're going to take a Q-tip and you're going to put the perfect pearls on uh, with the Q-tip. Now remember when you put this onto the uh, to the stamp uh, or what you've stamped on there, you want to push the perfect pearls into the ink. Correct, and with a Q-tip, you can put it in specific places. You want it in specific places on this particular uh, 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 start stamp card that we're going to be doing. Is uh, you're, you're doing a lovely job, Quinn. You're just pushing the pushing the pearls into the wings and the beak. It's and always the, nice to have it into the beak at the tail. You don't want to miss the tail or the feet or the feet. So you keep pressing down until you can clearly see the image. Yes, you should be able to see the image uh, uh, as, you're, as you're pushing down on the Q-tip and pushing it into the stamp, the Versamark ink. This is great product uh, that, that works really well. I want to remind you also, too, that if you're doing this and once you finish your card and you have anything in your store that you want to use to embellishment, you embellish it, you can embellish it with uh, all different kinds of items in your store. Use it. Uh, this is just a simple, basic guideline for you to be able to use this. So you could go ahead and add ribbons or any kind of trim, maybe gemstones. And the other thing you want to remember too is when you're doing this, you always want to work from the lightest color to the darkest color. Correct. That way, if it blends, it blends light to dark. Correct. Doing a great job on that, Gwen. Thank you. Okay. Probably should have put a little piece of paper down there so you didn't spill all that perfect pearl onto the uh, foam pad. Oh, it's just more artistic that way. Is it? Okay. It sounds like somebody's knocking on the door. Nope, nobody's here. Nobody's here. Okay, the next thing right. we're going to do is just... What are we doing? Rub it with Swifter. We're going to rub it in with the Swifter pad. Gently. Yeah. Make sure you use a clean one, not the one used on your floor. And what it will do is pick up any excess. It's going to pick up the excess. Oh, that's starting to look sharp now. You can see it happening uh, in the camera. Wipe it up. Oh, that's very nice. Oh, you're even getting it off of the uh, off the foam pad. Good for you. And there you go. And then you can just go ahead and layer it. You can layer it on, uh, on and uh, make a card out of it. Go ahead and just decide what colors... We've like decided on these colors, uh, yellow, and then a blue with a black background, uh, or black card. And go ahead and put it on the black card, and there you go. There you go. Uh, tape it all on, and uh, you're ready you're to ready rock to and go. roll. 